Hello and welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to show you how to add moving average lines to your Excel graph. So consider this following example. You are an investor and you um, track your portfolio for a considerable amount of time. And uh, you have a sheet where all the data is stored in. And now you want to add the 20 day, 50 day and 100 day moving average lines. So just as a quick reminder, the moving day average explained means it is the moving average as a technical term used in uh, oftentimes uh, trading or day trading but also long-term investing and it is um, the average closing price of an asset for a pre-specified time frame so for example the 20-day moving average um, time frame is of course as the name suggests 20 days the formula is relatively simple we just sum up all the days um, up to that point of time. So for example, for the 20 day moving averages, um, we would add up the first 20 days worth of data and then divide it by 20. So let's do it. So we go um, to the first day in, um, in which we have the 20 days worth of data. So we go to um, because I started in line 3 we go to um, 22 and we just um, use the sum formula of the 20 days and then divide it by 20 we do the same for the 50 day average and then divide it by 50 100 day average so now that you have the data you just want to add it to your graph in case you don't know you just um, click the graph go to chart design go to select data add a new data uh, a new data series let's call it 20 day and we use this so you can just um, you can just select the whole column in case you don't have any other information in this column stored. Then we want to add 50 days. Select that. And last but not least, 100 days. Got that. And now it's added to your graph. So if it was helpful, please consider liking or subscribing, and in any case, have a nice day. Bye-bye.